What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video now today boys we have a player review on the 93 rated Summer Heat Mendy um, This card is currently in objectives until the rest of the end of the season But the real question on everyone's mind is whether or not this card is worth your time and effort in order to grind and unlock the card We're gonna figure that out today and uh, yeah, should be pretty fun now looking at the card overall uh, He's got five star skills five star weak foot unheard of on a wing back ever uh, so that's pretty unreal on top of that good work rates with high medium work rates He's got a 5 foot 11 build in game um, And if you guys have played with foot miss Mendy, you guys know that the the player build of Mendy um, It's a pretty ideal one for the left back position now on top of that what he offers you is those links those very very crucial links to fit into your ultimate team um, if you're playing him a left back of course uh, you're going to be getting links to the center backs from Real Madrid you guys know the ones Ramos Varane and of course flashback Eder Militao um, those are three pretty pretty used meta center backs in this game so a lot of people are using them on top of that as well um, if you guys are running any sort of 4-3-3 uh, you can link him to your center mid, any sort of French center mids, or even like a Fakir or a Foot Birthday Griezmann. You could link him out up like that. Um, and then also in a 4 5 1, you can link him to a left wing, for example, um, a Tots Griezmann. Or you could even do uh, a left wing 90 rated Mbappe. So a lot of linkable options um, that you've got to offer. Um, you could even do, like, for example, Hazard as well. We, we all know that the SPC, ha SPC Hazard is still out. Um, and available so incredible incredible links across the board, um, but that is not all he offers He's also got some in unbelievable stats um, That make him usable in a multiple amount of positions But what we're gonna be trying him out today is left back um, now when we go across to the stats you guys can see um, This man has got some unbelievable unbelievable stats uh, We're talking with an anchor which is my preferred camp style. You could also use a backbone um, or a sentinel or a guardian whatever you want to use uh, but for me I'm gonna use an anchor and um Putting an anchor on him pretty much gives him maxed out physical with the only non-maxed out stat uh, being strength and 95. On top of that, you're going to get that defensive boost uh, to max out his stand tackle and slide tackle. His defensive awareness goes to 97 and his interceptions goes to 95. And on top of that, you're going to max out his pace to 99. Um, now, the other thing that this card offers, uh, which allows you to play him in multiple positions, including CDM, uh, left wing if you really wanted to, or left mid in like a 3-5-2. Uh, you could even play him in an attacking role, but the finishing's a bit low, so you might want, might want to boost the uh, the, the finishing stats uh, but the card the stats that make him so so versatile um, are the agility and balance and dribbling on the card um, this card is going to feel very very responsive just from those three stats alone um, and on top of that he's got good very very good composure and reactions um, and then on top of that you're looking at the passing stats with vision up in 90 uh, short passing in 94 and long passing in 93 which um, are incredible incredible stats. So overall the car looks incredible. Um, you can play him in a multiple uh, different amount of positions and um, Just looks like a very very versatile versatile card. I don't pay too much attention uh, to traits to be honest But he has got flare traits and I don't really know what speed dribbler does uh, But I mean, I think flare allows you to do some of those fancy passes and shots if uh, that's what you like and uh, yeah it's, it's an overall amazing looking card. Now, the way we're going to review him today is we're going to go into some Foot Champs games. You guys will see uh, we've already got three games played with him, but um, I haven't started my Foot Champs for this weekend. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to rock this team. I'm also going to be trying out the Kese, um, but I'm not really going to do a review on him. If you guys want to know my opinion, uh, you can go over quick little cheeky plug to our Twitch. The link is down in the description below. Uh, usually, I, I, I like to review a couple cards in a weekend league. Uh, so I'm going to be doing the Kese, but I think by the time this video goes out, the Kese is not gonna, no longer be going to be an objective, so that's a bit unfortunate. But that's the reason why we're doing the Mendy, preferably, um, is you guys can still get an opinion uh, whilst you can still get the cards. So anyway, this is the team that we're going to be rocking for uh, this week in League. Um, usually for me, I like to play more than just two or three games to get an idea of the card. And uh, for me today, we're going to be playing the full 30 games across the entirety of the weekend. I'm probably only going to show maybe five to ten games on the actual video. Um, but yeah, we're going to play 30 games with this card, see how he goes, and then we're going to give you an opinion on the end. Um, the other card that we're also trying out brand new this weekend is T Tots Ramos. Uh, but I can imagine this card is going to be so, so, so good. Uh, so I don't really have a problem. And yes, this is a pretty, pretty overpowered team. This is our road to glory that we've been using for the past couple weeks. Um, and of course, after Tots, usually everyone has pretty stacked teams. So... Anyway, boys, enough chitter chatter. Let's see whether or not this Mendy holds up to the standard that he ha that he seems like he should hold up to with the level and quality of this card. Um, so let's get into the games. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. 
Our main cards we want to try out, though, is the left side, so... Uh, hopefully they do all right. But the thing is now, is I can... I can't even do it. Uh, there we go. I can Elastico and Mendy. Let's go. Thank you, Ramos. Oh, Mendy. That was, to be fair, not really his fault. It's very off balance. I don't know. We got we to gotta focus, boys. We got to focus. I got I to gotta bring this game back. Let's go hold it. Let's go hold it. Respect it. Is something coming out later? Do you mean in FIFA? I'm assuming something's coming out. I, I, I'd assume there'll be another SBC card. I kind of want to see Usman. Okay, Mendy, that is suspect. Bro, it is choppy though. It is really choppy. Go on, Mendy. Oh, Mendy. With a crunching tackle. <laughs> Go on, Mendy. Oh, look at him. He is a machine, boys. And the thing is, right, it's not a problem that he's higher up than Royce because he's got the five-star, five-star. You know? Dribbling on point. Passing very, very good. Finds the open Kessie. Kessie into Neymar! Neymar! <laughs> and that's 3-0. Uh, but yeah, nah, Mendy's Men incredible. Back to Mendy. Oh, I created the angle. Oh, he's offside, though. Having having Elasticos on Mendy is actually huge, man. Allows you to create the, those angles when people don't expect it. Bruh, he has the ability to keep the ball there as well. That's insane, man. Ball went out. Back to Mendy again. Oh. Mendy. Oh, stop it, Mendy. <laughs> oh, too many skills. He's got the fight, though. He's got that fight, you know? He's one of those cards. <laughs> oh man! I don't know if you've tried this Ramos. This uh this Ramos is crazy, man. He's insane. Oh look at Mendy. Look at him go. Look at him go. You can't catch him. Mendy! <laughs> oh Furlad Mendy. Great tackle, but then I I, I press clear accidentally. Uh, Ibra Car looks absolutely incredible. And uh, I'm going to try and get him at some point. Um, I want to play with him. I want to try out uh, Bruno Fernandes. He looks incredible as well. Okay, Mendy, this is where you need to shine, boy. Um, oh, look at the defense from Mendy. The composure on the ball to roll Sancho. Oh, bang. What a ball. Mendy, man, with this long passing, bro. He's incredible. Oh, boys just can't finish it. <laughs> man, trying to rainbow flick him, mate. And he says not today. Let's nice pass. Oh, go on, Mendy. Into Neymar. Into Bappe. Bang. There we go, boys. Nice off, Mendy. Solid, solid. Nice work, Mendy. That's huge from Mendy. Oh, Dino, man. He's got that that BS ability about him. Nice tackle, Mendy. Bro, Mendy is so good. Come on, Mendy. Bro, Mendy's solo, man. Oh. Just in full. Nice work, Mendy. Woo! Nice work, Mendy. Beautiful. Sancho! 
Sancho! Let's go! <laughs> oh, 2-2. Two, two. Alrighty, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the gameplay clips there with Mendy. If you guys couldn't tell, he is absolutely insane. Uh, so, so, so good. And I think he's probably the best left back I've used for the uh, for this entire year. And he's going to be starting in my team for the rest of the year. So, um, very, very, very happy to have this card. And I think um, he is very much worth it. Now, um, if you guys couldn't tell, uh, we had about... 14 to 15 to 16 games uh, worth of gameplay footage there and uh, the main reason for that was is I wanted to show you guys gameplay clips of what he offers at left back over any other left back uh, whether it be comes to the five star skills with some of the elasticos and some of the skill moves he can play as a winger um on top of that, you've also got his agility, his ball control, all that sort of stuff. On the ball movement, he feels incredible. Defensively, he's so, so strong. The recovery speed's incredible. And uh, yeah, just an overall amazing, amazing player. So that's why I try to get uh, some better clips. I might even put up some of just the regular clips here. And uh, this is just showing off that, yes, he's doing so much more throughout the games um, that I showed off. But they're just whatever any regular left back would normally do, you know what I mean? Uh, so that's why I kind of tried to uh, sift through that many games to get you guys some important clips so you can see what he offers you at left back and why he's so, so, so good. Now, of course, with that being said, um, because I had to sift through so many games, that means the video is going to be coming out a bit later for you guys. I think it's going to come out with maybe a, a, a week and a half left on the Mendy objective. So um, that's a bit unfortunate, but there's still time to do them uh, if you do really, really want to do them. And we'll talk about whether or not he's worth and what the best option for you guys to do uh, would be. But um, coming off this weekend league, uh, he actually we actually managed to finish 27 and 3, which was huge. So we got elite one rewards on the road to glory uh, for our accounts. Uh, so you guys will probably see that in a later video. I think I'm going to do a whole video about uh, summer heat for champs rewards and show you guys what we got throughout the entirety of summer heat instead of uh, clumping them up into just one video per week. I think that's the better way to do it for me. Now, also on top of that, boys, because it took us such a long time uh, to actually edit all the video clips together, I actually managed to play with them in a 3 5 2. Um, and I used them as a left mid. And I must say, um, I'm not going to show you all the ga gameplay clips with him at the left mid. Um, but I'm going to show you one right here where he scores a banging green time across body shot. He was incredible at uh, the left mid position. So, so, so good. Um, I had Frank Ribery playing um, the right mid position. And then I swapped Ribery and Firmino to play him at striker. I just wanted to try Ribery as well. Um, but yeah, Mendy at the, the left mid position in the 3-5-2 was absolutely insane. And uh, yeah, he, he again, they can play, he can play in so many positions. So uh, whether or not, here's the real verdict for you guys. Uh, is he worth your time? Is he worth your effort? Uh, should you go ahead and complete this objective mini card? And for me personally, I think this is a no-brainer. No if you're a t what's called player who's still playing this game regularly, if you're playing some weekend leagues, if you've got someone like an Edra Miller Tau, even now coming up to the, the current day, I think I missed out with this, uh, but there is like Usman Dembele's Summer Heat card, as well as, um, I believe we've got, I can't remember who it is, Vinicius Jr. at left wing. Um... There's a lot of Summer Heat cards that are linked to this card. So I think for the links that he offers and the fact that he's the best left back in the game, if you do have the time to go out and grind this card, and you can do it at the same time as you're doing other objectives, if you still got to do Bruno, um, if you still got to do Ebra, if you're going to do Mbabu, stuff like that. Um, yeah, th this card is definitely 100% worth it. Now, if you don't want to go all the way, I can even recommend you guys doing the 89 one. I don't think you need to win anything besides the first five games to get the 85 one. Um, but yeah, the 89 one is definitely 100% worth it as well. So um, I think that that'll be a thing. But if you can get the 93, um, this is going to be the best left back in the game for the rest of the year. Um, 100%. There's no way that like um, I can see any other card. Just for what he offers when it comes to skill moves, weak foot, uh, attacking ability, defensive ability. Um, he's just too, too, too good. And I think there were a few mistakes uh, maybe at the start of the video. But like for me personally, looking back on those and being analytical of my gameplay... Um, they're actually just my own faults. The first one uh, was a misplaced pass. I think I just passed it off balance. Um, so yeah, that was the case with that. And then the second one was legitimately uh, just me holding sprint. And then he took a very, very heavy touch. And I think I said that's a very heavy touch there from Mendy. Uh, but at the time, I didn't realize that, yeah, I'm just holding sprint and I shouldn't be doing that. 
And uh, yeah, he's just an incredible, incredible card. So I can't recommend this card enough. And uh, if you guys have the ability to do him over the next weekend and a half, if you haven't done him already, would 100% recommend. And uh, yeah, he's he's a, such a sen sensational card. Now, uh, going forward for us, because of course, I'm, I'm kind of running a bit low on video ideas, but I think I think we should be all right with it. Um, what I think we're going to do is... Um, I think we're going to actually try out this team and uh, we're going to compare for you guys. So coming up in the video soon, hopefully, uh, we will have Usman Dembele uh, versus uh, the bad boy Frank Ribéry. Uh, I haven't, what's it, I played a few games with Ribéry. I think I played like 16 games with Ribéry. Um, I haven't played at all with Usman. And a lot of people have been saying to me, yo, which one should I be doing? Should I be doing Usman? Uh, should I be doing Ribri? So, come on up with a video, video soon. Uh, you guys will get to see that. So, hopefully you guys are keen for that. And uh, we'll, be, we'll be checking out the differences between those two. Uh, but anyway, boys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, can't recommend this card again once enough. If you have the time, if you have the ability to do so, go and get this card. He is so, so, so good. But thank you guys for watching the video today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you have any, like, criticisms or um, anything you would like to see going forward from now onwards. Um... But yeah, thank you guys for watching so much. I appreciate it. Um, if you haven't already, go check out the Twitch channel. The link is down in the description below. We usually stream some of our weekend league games as well as uh, rewards and sometimes a midweek objective stream. And uh, yeah, we, we just uh, chill out and have some fun with FIFA. Um, and then also on top of that, if you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Drop a big old thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment down below. Let us know what you thought about the video. And anyway, boys, that's enough jibber jabber. Thank you guys for watching the video today. I appreciate you all. Uh, much love. Take care. Have a good one. And peace. Broken